smile costs nothing, but gives much. Be more concerned with your character than with your reputation. For your character is what you are, while your reputation is merely what others think you are. Fear doesn't exist anywhere, except in the mind. If you want to change people, why not begin on yourself? That is a lot more profitable and a lot less dangerous. Knowledge isn't power until it is applied. Develop success from failures. Discouragement and failure are two of the surest stepping stones to success. People are not interested in you. They are not interested in me. They are interested in themselves. Morning, noon, and after dinner. Of course your husband has a lot of drawbacks. If he had none, he would never marry you. When fate hands you lemons, make lemonade. Criticisms are like homing pigeons. They always return home. Most of the important things in the world have been accomplished by people who have kept on trying when there seemed to be no hope at all. The desire for the feeling of importance is one of the chief distinguishing differences between mankind and the animals. The expression one wears on one's face is far more important than the clothes one wears on one's back. Success is getting what you want. Happiness is wanting what you get. Listening carefully to a person is the greatest compliment we can give him. The load of tomorrow added to that of yesterday carried today makes the strongest falter. The successful man will profit from his mistakes and try again in a different way. People sometimes became invalids in order to win sympathy and attention and get a feeling of importance. Do the hard jobs first. The easy jobs will take care of themselves. The gun that scatters too much does not bag the birds. Man is not made to understand life, but to live it. Smile. Today is the tomorrow you worried about yesterday. Always make the other person happy about doing the thing you suggest. Keep busy. It's the cheapest kind of medicine there is on this earth, and one of the best. People rarely succeed unless they have fun in what they are doing. Our thoughts make us what we are. To be interesting, be interested. One reason why birds and horses are not unhappy is because they are not trying to impress other birds and horses. Happiness doesn't depend on any external conditions. It is governed by our mental attitude. Only knowledge that is used sticks in your mind. You cannot teach a man anything. You can only help him to find it within himself. A person's name 
is to that person the sweetest and most important sound in any language. If you want to gather honey, don't kick over the beehive. Personally, I am very fond of strawberries and cream, but I have found that for some strange reason, fish prefer worms. So when I went fishing, I didn't think about what I wanted. I thought about what fish wanted. By all means, take thought for tomorrow. Yes, careful thought and planning and preparation. But have no anxiety. Two men looked out from prison bars. One saw the mud. The other saw stars. Talk to someone about themselves and they'll listen for hours. There's only one way to get the best of an argument, and that is to avoid it. Criticism is dangerous because it wounds a person's pride, hurts his sense of importance, and arouses resentment. Remember, happiness doesn't depend upon who you are or what you have. It depends solely upon what you think. You can make more friends in two months by becoming interested in other people than you can in two years by trying to get other people interested in you. Our fatigue is often caused not by work, but by worry, frustration, and resentment. If you want to keep happiness, you have to share it. Any fool can criticize, condemn, and complain. And most fools do. You will never achieve real success unless you like what you're doing. Ask yourself, what is the worst that can happen? Then prepare to accept it. Then proceed to improve on the worst. Happiness is not mostly pleasure, it is mostly victory. Flaming enthusiasm, backed up by horse sense and persistence, is the quality that most frequently makes for success. Every successful person loves the game, the chance to prove his worth, to excel, to win. Inaction breeds doubt and fear. Action breeds confidence and courage. If you want to conquer fear, do not sit home and think about it. Go out and get busy. People are more likely to accept an order if they had a part in the decision that caused the order to be issued. A rouse in the other person an eager want. He who can do this has the whole world with him. Take a chance. All life is a chance. The man who goes furthest is generally the one who is willing to do and dare. Success in dealing with people depends on a sympathetic grasp of the other person's viewpoint. Feeling sorry for yourself and your present condition is not only a waste of energy, but the worst habit you could possibly have. If you can't sleep, then get up and do something instead of lying there and worrying. It's the worry that gets you, not the loss of sleep. Every man is a damn fool for at least five minutes every day. Wisdom consists in not exceeding that limit. Influencing others 
is not a matter of outsmarting them. It is a matter of discerning what they truly want and offering it to them in a mutually beneficial package. Pay less attention to what men say. Just watch what they do. Act as if you were already happy, and that will tend to make you happy. It isn't what you have, or who you are, or where you are, or what you are doing that makes you happy or unhappy. It is what you think about. People don't have many friends, because as kids, they didn't learn to trust people. The only way to influence people is to talk in terms of what the other person wants. Three-fourths of the people you will ever meet are hungry and thirsty for sympathy. Give it to them, and they will love you. Try to pretend to be a fool, and you'll get the whole truth from a man. An individual who unselfishly tries to serve others has an enormous advantage. Are you bored with life? Then throw yourself into some work you believe in with all your heart. Live for it. Die for it. And you will find happiness that you had thought could never be yours. Let's not allow ourselves to be upset by small things we should despise and forget. Remember, life is too short to be little. For many centuries, nobles and magnates supported artists, musicians, and authors so that their creative works would be dedicated to them. Everything that is in agreement with our personal desires seems true. Everything that is not puts us into a rage.